So today I'll be sharing with you my favorite mask. So maybe you can also want to try it as well. Okay, so here goes. This is one of my favorite exfoliating masks. It's the Body Shop Maison Asai mask. Um, this is one of my favorites. I tried it. I've been using it for the last two years, two to three years, and um, it has got beads in it. So the texture is actually very nice. It's like this. It's slightly on the rough side, so it's very good for exfoliating your face, um, especially when sometimes you feel like when you put on makeup and your foundation doesn't um, look so nice. That's when I start doing the masking for using this exfoliating mask because it helps to actually remove all the impurities from the face um, especially when you put on makeup so often um, sometimes it tends to be a little bit rough the next day when you use your foundation so I use this to actually exfoliate my face so I do not use this every day I use it about two times a week and I don't use it on a continuous like two days because um, it will actually dry up your skin so I use this like twice a week and I split it up like if I use it on a Monday, I will use it on a like a Friday, so I will um, speed up the duration of the usage of this mask. This is one of my favorite masks from Body Shop, and I think to me, I think this is probably the best mask from Body Shop. Yeah, so try it out. Okay, the next mask is actually the Ethiopian honey mask that I also got from Body Shop. Uh, this is actually in a honey texture. It's really like the honey that you eat. So it's like this. So I, I like this mask because this is more like a hydrating mask. It doesn't have any beads. It's just um, like for hydrating your face, uh, especially like on a very hot day. It's good to actually use this. Um, I like it. Uh, I like the after feel of it when you actually remove the 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 mask. But the only problem with this um, is when you actually rinse it off, it's a little bit of a challenge um, because it's actually quite hard to get rid of everything on your face. So when I remove um, the texture, when I remove this mask from my face, right, I will um, also apply cleanser to actually remove it because this mask is actually quite hard to um, remove. So I think that's the only um, thing about this mask but otherwise the after feel of it is actually very good because it actually hydrates my face especially after work sometimes I go out um, to work and um, I go out in the sun so I would like to use this after my appointments okay the next one is the um, Himalayan charcoal mask also from body shop um, this is uh, I bought I managed to get this in the travel size just to try it out um, this one is actually has got a lot of um, clay texture in it so um, it's good for, exfol for exfoliating your face as well uh, this one is a little bit on the drying side so I would recommend you use it like once a week um, just like the acai mask to um, exfoliate all the impurities on your face um, I find it uh, usually I have ex uh, you know a lot of um, bumps and all this on the nose so this is actually very good to remove impurities on your nose and especially this part and also maybe your chin area so this is good for like a once a week mask it's the Body Shop Himalayan Charcoal Mask so they have it in travel size as well so you can actually try it to travel size first before you get the fold size okay the next one is also a Body Shop Mask it's the Japanese Matcha Tea Mask I like this uh, it's very light it's very soft Oh, I'm finishing already. So this is also in the travel size. So this one, um, I use it like about three, two to three times a week because this is actually on the more hydrating side. It's not drying to the skin. So I actually use it uh, after, when I come back from work, I like to use this mask. It's very hydrating. and It doesn't dry up your skin at all. So you can give it a try. Okay. Um, this one is also very good. Uh, I don't know how you pr pronounce it. And ease. Okay, so this one I actually got it from Venus. It's only like six dollars or five dollars, so it's really really affordable. And this one is uh, in a oatmeal oatmeal mask. Um, it's also very good for removing impurities on my face because sometimes I find if I use too much makeup in a week, I will have the tendency to have a bit of impurities on the nose and the 
the forehead so I'll use this I'll use this at least once a week um, probably not more than once a week because it's a little bit drying as well so this is really good it's got a bit of um, oats texture in it so um, you can actually use it as an exfoliator as well so I'll put it on for, for about 20 minutes and rinse it off this one is a little bit hard to rinse off as well so you may need to use your cleanser to remove um, the whole mask but it's very very the texture is very nice after you use it so I use this for once a week it's, uh, I think it's probably available at Watson's as well you can give it a try I love this this is nice okay and uh, I have got sheet masks as well which I use um, sheet masks I think are the best um, they are very hydrating especially for like Singapore weather it's really hot throughout the year and I love to use this especially after I finish my work and I come back from my appointments uh, especially in the sun I'm out in the sun this is really good so this is from hold on this is from the face shop okay I recommended this to my mom as well I bought about 30 pieces for her and she loved it um, it's really good for hydrating your face it whitens your face it really really whitens your face after using it for like I just put it on for like half an hour and I watch Netflix with it so it's really really hydrating it really whitens my face I can really see my face getting fairer after one usage so I use this uh, at least two about two times a week because you can actually use this every day as well it's very hydrating and it's good for whitening and brightening so this is the one in cucumber it's the face shop real nature range is the cucumber one is really really good uh, and another one which is really good is also the lemon one the lemon one is also very hydrating and it also whitens my face so I will always order these two and I'll use you know in alternate one day I'll use this and one day I'll use the lemon one so get two these two if you want they have got a quite a number of range for this uh, real nature range but um, these two are happens to be the best which I really really love I've been using this for about um, four years and I really love it so it really whitens my face and brightens my face after one single use so I swear by this and this so do give this a try and this is quite affordable as well I actually get it online and there's, they always sell in um, bulk of like 10 pieces so it's slightly cheaper and you save on your postage as well so this is really good do give it a try so this is the end of my sharing for all the masks I hope you guys give it a try as well um, I hope you enjoy this video I'll see you soon bye